So if you want to talk about leadership, the best place to start the movies is with The Wizard of Oz. Because think about Dorothy. Here's this little girl. A little girl that most of the time when she's telling folks things, her parents or her step-parents don't believe. Aunt Auntie M doesn't believe her. She's always bothering people. The farmhands pay no attention to her. And then she winds up in this fantasy world called Oz. And who does she have as her lieutenants? First of all, a guy that's totally clueless, the Scarecrow. He is the most clueless person you could imagine. Then there's a Tin Man. He thinks he doesn't have a heart. Now, that's not, it's not, that doesn't mean he's heartless in the sense of cruel, but it means that he lacks will. He's, he, we would call him a burnout case in a modern organization. But in this particular case, he's, a, he's, he's rusted. He's just tired. If you've got an organization with 100 people, 12 of them, and you've been around for a while, 12 of them fall into this category. And finally, of course, there's the lion, a guy who is, is frightened to do anything, no guts. So you got somebody with no guts, you got somebody with no will, and you got somebody that's totally clueless. And this little girl manages to meld them into this terrific leadership team, working together, finds the thing that they don't know they have that is within them, and makes it all happen so that they accomplish their goals and they accomplish them with terrific skill and competence.